All right, all right. What's up, Fight fans? Man, I want to point out something during the Wilder interview with 78, and that was towards the end of the interview where Wilder begins to break down crying. So he had a moment where he started breaking down, reflecting on um, really his career, what people thought about him, his support, and things like that. But even before he got to this point about crying, he brought up a fa about the thing about him and his trainer, Malik Scott, and how sensitive they are and how they just break out and crying if they're talking about something. That's not a fucking good thing. That's not good at all. Uh, uh, two sentimental guys working together in this very dangerous ass sport. And then to see him in this interview for the first time to break down in the manner in which he did. Uh, it, it's, you know, it's not nothing, you know, it's okay for, for a man to cry, but it can be alarming being there's a rush of emotions that's coming out. But also I want to do another video about another point he talked about, and that's the sparring leading into this uh, fight is this camp is that he struggled in sparring. And I think Junior Fa was brought in there. So that means he must have been having trouble with these guys. And that's probably why they implement this plan about moving and staying away. Uh, but he has to know that things aren't the same. And being his pride and him being a warrior, he has to be safe from himself. Man, he's going to continue to push through it. It's just what's in his heart. It's in his makeup. He's going to try to fight through things, even though things are changing he doesn't recognize it or want to accept it and the fact that to me people around him are yes people even the guy I interview him 78 is a yes person too wild they're out of his loyalty and what he believes is loyalty is misinterpretation of what loyalty is and friendship is uh he has an ignorant understanding of what the term does as much as many people in society does uh, it's just a common thing within society people's ignorance of wording and meaning and true friendship and what true loyalty is. People don't know what the fuck the words mean. <laughs> so um, it's alarming, man. And uh, I don't want to see this dude hurt in the fucking ring versus people wanting to see him get back and getting a win and shit like that, man. But that's all I got. Peace.